Hey what's up guys? In this video I'll be showing you how you can repair corrupted or even damaged PST files on your computer and recover all the emails that were lost from it. But what I'm going to do in this video is I'll make use of a PST repair tool that I found on this link. With this PST repair tool I was able to repair PST files of all sizes as well as PST files from all Outlook versions. So what I'm going to do now is I'll run this PST repair tool on my PST file and I'll show you how you can repair PST files using this software. So let's get back to the software. And here's how the main screen of this application looks like when you launch it on your computer. Open PST file, find PST file and select Outlook profile. The first option that is open PST file lets you Browse and select the PST file if you know the exact location of the PST file on your computer. Well, most of us wouldn't know the exact location of the PST file. In such scenarios, you can go with the second option where the software will scan your computer and will locate the PST file, which can then be used for repair. Anyway, for this video, I already have the PST file on my desktop, so I'll go with the first option that is open PST file. So I'll click on the browse button that I see here and select the PST file that I'm looking to repair. So I've chosen the PST file. So what I'm going to do is I'll click on the next button and proceed further. You find two scanning methods that is normal scan and smart scan. Normal scan is relatively fast and will fix most of the errors on your PST file. Suppose if normal scan couldn't fix your PST file, then you can go with the second option that is smart scan, which implements a more rigorous scanning method and will make sure that your PST file is repaired. So after selecting one of the two scanning methods, come down and click on the browse button that you see here and select a folder to which you would like to save the repaired PST file. So once the PST file has been repaired, the new repaired PST file will be saved to this folder. That is PST folder which I already created on my desktop. So what I'll do here is I'll click on the repair button and repair the PST file which I chose in the previous step. And now the software begins to repair my PST file. So as the repair process progresses, the software will recover all the emails and other Outlook attributes that were present in my PST file. So what I'm going to do here is I'll wait for the repair process to complete, after which I'll be presented with all the emails and other stuff that was recovered from my Outlook profile. And we're done with the repair process and you can see that these were all the emails that were recovered from my Outlook PST file. I can click on destination which will take me directly to the folder where the repaired PST file is saved to. This repaired PST file can also be imported to my existing Outlook profile so that I can get back access to all my emails and other Outlook attributes. To know the procedure, I can click on this option that I see here which gives me the procedure on how to import the PST file to my existing Outlook profile. So these are all the Outlook attributes that were recovered from my Outlook PST file which includes 621 emails as well as 64 sent items from my Outlook profile. So this is all it takes to repair corrupted or even damaged PST files on your Outlook by making use of this repair tool. So guys if you are looking to repair your PST files on your computer then just get this tool from the link that I've given below and repair all your PST files in a safe and secure manner. The software supports to repair PST files from all Outlook versions and is one of the most recommended softwares that you'll find to repair your Outlook PST file. Anyway, thanks for watching guys. Goodbye.